Yo, what's up guys? So today we've got another golden blind post that I wanted to share with you guys. And this one is titled, is Google food really that bad? So let's just jump right into it. The OP says, hey friend, just joined Google in Kirkland. He is vegetarian and doesn't eat cheese. This was dinner one day last week. And it looks like he's got a photo of a plate with some fruit and some tortilla chips. <laughs> is the food at Google really this limited? I've heard Meta has tons of options for vegan every day. And I think that's it. Yeah, this looks pretty limited. I don't know if the OP is trolling or not, or if this was from just like a little happy hour event or something like that, where the menu item is a lot more limited. But I'm just going to give you guys my personal opinion on this because I was at Google for about three years. And I will tell you this right now that Google food is pretty damn good. I worked in the Mountain View Sunnyvale campus. And I remember I lived about five or 10 minutes away. And back then I would pretty much bike to work in the morning. I would grab breakfast work, grab a snack, work, eat lunch, work, grab dinner, work out, and then go home. And the food is free. There's a lot of different options and menus. The way it works is almost every building that Google operates has a espresso bar, a micro kitchen, or even a cafe. Most buildings I think have cafes. Some of them are better than others, but you definitely get a lot of variety because every building has something unique that they specialize in. You know, some of them might have Indian food for a lot of the engineers to keep them happy, or some of them might have special Asian, Chinese, Japanese, Korean food to keep the Asian population happy. And that's just the way it works. There's a ton of variety. It constantly rotates every single day. And they also have this thing called the Google 15, where they say that after about a year, you gain 15 pounds because of all the food that you're given for free. Not to mention the micro kitchen that I talked about, which is pretty much a fully stocked kitchen every day where people come in and that you can grab all kinds of snacks, energy bars. I think the last couple of years I worked there, they did start to kind of have a lot more healthier options, which I think in this photo, you can kind of see that the fruit option is definitely giving you those, those health vibes there. But this does not represent the full menu at Google. Even if you were working in a different building, different location, most of the food at different offices, some are better than others, obviously, but at least for Mountain View and some of the other satellite offices that I visited, they were all pretty good. So I'm pretty sure this guy's trolling or this is a happy hour event where they just didn't have many options. Maybe he arrived late and there's pretty much just fruit and tortilla chips left, but this absolutely does not represent the majority of the food that you get at Google. I did hear stories though, when the company first started and they started to get a lot of funding from VCs and other investors that they had steaks, ribeyes, shrimp, lobsters, but obviously as the company grows and scales, you're not gonna be able to afford that and serve you know, 50, 60, 80,000 employees anymore. So I don't think that's realistic, but I can tell you the food at Google is pretty good. Now, he also made the point about Meta having good food. Meta, of course, as we all know, is Facebook. I would say also the food at Facebook is pretty good. I visited a couple friends there on a couple of occasions, and I would say it's pretty on par with Google. Maybe a little bit better with a little bit more... Actually, I can't even say if it has more variety. All I remember is I went there when they had a, a huge barbecue truck come out, and it was catered, and it was pretty damn good. But of course, with the recession and the economy the way it is, I'm pretty sure that a lot of these tech companies are going to have to make some some cuts to their food budget because everyone is struggling right now, some more than others. Anyways, guys, that's just my two cents on this post. Let me know what you guys think. If you've ever worked at Google, if you have a unique experience that you want to share, drop it in the comments down below and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.